Hello students, now you can see the types of functions. For a function, you have four types. One one function, many one function, onto function, into function. First, we see the one one function. A function f from a to b is called one one function if distinct elements of a have distinct images in b distinct elements of a have distinct images in b take two sets here three elements here four elements for every element in the first set if you take a from A to B, you have a image separately. That is, if for every element in A, you have one image in B. Distinct element of A have distinct images in B. Here the element or image. Thirumba the same element Okay, that is distinct. Distinct element of A have distinct images. One more thing, a 1 1 function is also called an injection. Okay, one more name for 1 1 function that is injection. See another one example for 1 1. Set A and B, the functions are drawn here. For 1, you have an image A. For 2, you have an image B. For 3, you have an image D. For 4, you have an image C. For every element in A, you have a distinct image in B. Therefore, this is a 1-1 one, one function. Now, see the second type, many 1 function. A function f from A to B is called many 1 function if 2 or more elements of A have same image in B. See the example here. You have the elements A, B, C, D, E, F, G or the elements of capital A. 1, 2, 3 or the elements of capital B. See the function A, C, D have an image 1. That is many elements. That is two or more elements of A have same image in B. Understand? 1 or more than 1. Okay. Two or more elements of A, that is A, C, D, have the same image in B, that is many elements. To remember, take many and one, okay, many one function. See, B and D have an image two. Then, F and G have the same image in B. For example, one more thing you can remember, that is, person filling more person that is more than one person joined in one filling okay mm. for remember you can use this example also once again one one means for one element in a have distinct element in b many one function means here two or more elements of a have same image in b See the third one, onto function. A function, small f, a to b is said to be onto function. If the range of f is equal to the codomain of f. See, what is codomain? Set a is domain, set b is codomain. Okay, domain, codomain. All the elements in B have an pre-image in A. That is the correct mean. All the elements in B, all the elements in the codomain have a pre-image in B. All the elements. That is onto function. One more name for onto function that is surjection. Okay. And onto function is also called a surjection. See one more example for onto. See here, A has an image 
P2 and A3 have an image P2. A2 only P1. A4 and A5 have an image P3. See from the right side that is from the codomain from the B set. Check P1, P2 and P3. All the elements in B have an pre-image in capital A. Therefore, it is an onto function. Fourth one, into function. A function f from a to b is called an into function if there exists at least one element in b, which is not the image of an element of a. Once again, at least one element in b, which is not the image of any element of a. See the example. 1, 2, 3 are the elements of A. W, X, Y, Z are the elements of B. See the function. 1, W, 2, Z, 3, X. Here you have an element Y in B. They didn't have the image in the A. Okay. Therefore, it is a into function. Once again. If any element, at least one element in B, which is not an image of any element of A, then immediately you can say this is an into function. Now you know about the bijection. If a function f from A to B is both 1, 1 and onto function, then f is called a bijection from A to B. See here one example you have 1, 2, 3 are the elements of A, W, X, Y, Z are the elements of B. What is the meaning for 1, 1 function? For every element in A have a distinct element image in B. Okay. See here 1, W, 2, Y, 3, X. Therefore, this is 1, 1. What is the meaning for on to every element in capital B as a pre-image of A? Okay, every element in capital B has a pre-image of capital B. That is W also you have a pre-image. X is also you have a pre-image. Y is also you have a pre-image. Therefore, this is onto. In this example, you have both the function 1, 1 and onto. You can say this is a bijection. Okay, if the function satisfies one one function and onto function then it is a bug action once again recall the types of function one 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 element in a as a distinct element in b okay that is distinct element of a have distinct image in b okay then many two 1 that is see here 1 and 2 have a okay 2 or more elements of a 2 or more elements okay and have same image in b then it is many to 1 for on to every element in b has a pre image in a every element in b have a pre image in a okay one more thing, all the codomain are the range of F. Yes, because all the elements have the pre-image. Okay, then what is the meaning for into at least one element? At least one element in B, which is not the image of any element in A. Okay. At least one element. Here you have E and F. For E and F, you didn't have the image of any element of A. Therefore, into function. Now you can see the horizontal line test. Okay. Already you know about the vertical line test that we finished. Okay. See here. Using the horizontal line test, you must find this is the uh, the diagram. This function is 1, 1 or not. Okay. See here, a function from here. 
a function represented in the graph is 1 1 if every horizontal line intersects the curve in at most one point for the vertical line test also we used in the same procedure only one point if touches means it is a function more than one point means you are decided that that is not a function here also like that see one example here using horizontal line test here you have three diagram determine which of the following functions are one one see here what is the meaning for horizontal line if you draw like this okay now your diagram is x x dash y y dash your graph is like this okay draw one horizontal line above the graph you can draw from the top to bottom anywhere now here you are drawing the graph touches at only one point therefore this is a one one function okay now see the second diagram here your graph is like this now draw a horizontal line here if you draw you will get two points if you draw here you get three points already you know if you have at most one point only one point means only this is a one one function therefore this is not a one one function now see the third diagram that is your graph is like this draw one horizontal line if you draw here also you will get only one point in anywhere if you draw the horizontal line you will get only one point therefore this is a one one function